Hey guys, so today I have a couple sapodillas that I picked off my tree from my backyard right there. Um, these are Silas Wood sapodillas. Um, they're a small variety Silas Wood, but these are also pretty small even for the Silas Wood variety. Um, I think it's because the tree is still pretty small. Um, I actually did a uh, full video of the tree. Um, so yeah, I've had this tree for um, I think about a year and a half. Um, I got it in a three gallon pot from Everglades Dot Farm. It's producing awesome, as you can see. So uh, yeah, let's give these a shot. All right, this is, it's pretty soft. You want it to be, um, you know, where it gives quite a bit. Uh, that's where it's most, um, it's where it's most right. Knife goes through really easily. Oh yeah, look at that. Really beautiful caramel color. There are some seeds come out really easily. Let's see if there's any more seeds. Not in that one. There's another seed on there. There's a couple seeds. All right, let's give it a taste. All right, really beautiful caramel color fruit. It actually tastes like caramel. Now, I eat the skin. Some people don't, some people do. Mmm. Mmm. So sweet. It tastes like brown sugar, caramel. Some people say apple pie. Um, doesn't really have the cinnamon, like that spice note. It's more just pure sugar, caramel, um, you know, molasses-y. Um, some sapodillas could be grainy. This is actually really nice and smooth. Mm. It's got a little juice, but it's mostly creamy. Mm, it just tastes like so sweet on a scale of sweetness. It's probably like a 9.5. Mm, delicious just to eat. Mm. Mm. Um, it's not refreshing. It's, you know, it just tastes very sweet. It's not, it has no citrus sourness to it. Um, probably give it a good, um, 8.7 as a fruit. How enjoyable it is to eat. Definitely one of my favorites. Mm. Um, you can find them in South Florida. I would highly recommend if you could find some uh, to give it a taste. Or contact me and maybe I'll ship them to you. I got a whole tree full of them. All right.